Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying four bars from uh, For You. These, I will probably pronounce them completely wrong. I'm going to say it and then we're just going to get over it because it's okay. Uh, these are Niederreger. Um, this is the uh, chocolate with a truffle filling. These are from Germany. Uh, this is the uh, milk chocolate with raspberry cream truffle. This is the truffle as well. It's cappuccino truffle. And then this one is, it just says marzipan, and you can read about it. Yeah, we'll talk about it in a minute, because it, there's more to it. Yeah. Um, these, like I said, they're all from Germany, but we found them at Jungle Gems International Market. They were $3.48 each, but they're, they they feel like they're uh, substantial. So, um, I thought it was worth paying that for them, because they it's just... black wrapper. I do too. They just feel like they're good-sized bars, but something from... From Germany, you know, that we had never had before. I feel like we've, we have tried a lot from Germany. So, um, this is a filled dark chocolate with mousse au chocolat truffle filling. <laughs> so <far. laughs> oh, a third of the bar, or 38 grams, is 190 calories. So, there's three servings in the bar. Describe your square. Are oh, these boxes sealed? They're stuck together. They're glued or oh. something. Wow. The wrapper inside's not sealed. It's mm. just folded. Mm. That is a very dark chocolate. But it is, but it has a flavor like something else about it. Like an alcohol maybe? It would make you think of alcohol. I don't think we don't think there's any alcohol. I don't think there's in any that, in there, but this but, flavor reminds me of something alcoholic yes. that I've had before, like a bourbon or something. But it's delicious. It um It is good. It dries your mouth a little bit like dark chocolate does. And there's a hint of bitterness, honestly, but I don't think it's bad. No, I, I think it's, it's not a bad bitterness. It's very creamy on the inside. Um that mousse. This piece that broke off, this is how much of that mousse stuff you get. <laughs> I like the... Because uh, it broke off. I like the crisp of the chocolate on oh, the yeah, outside. Oh yeah, you definitely get the crisp. Uh, the dark chocolate, the very good. Okay, so good I'm chocolate. excited to try this one. Uh, this is the raspberry. So, it says, this is milk chocolate too. Yeah. Okay, so we we're, we probably should have put this on in there. Because right. Usually we go from milk chocolate to dark, but that's okay. So this one is milk chocolate, filled milk chocolate with raspberry cream truffle filling. A fourth of the package, so you're, you're getting less. A fourth of the package is 130 calories. Mm, I like that middle. Wow. It's raspberry. That is delicious. Mm -hmm. Almost has like a almost strawberry-ish. I can see that. It's right. It's, you can tell it's raspberry. It's raspberry. It almost tastes like it has some strawberry mixed in with it. It's not as uh, tart, I mm -hmm. think, as the raspberry that we're, we've grown used to. Yeah. There's some sweetness in there, like a strawberry yeah, has. And I don't think that's, that's why Kevin's saying that. And no seeds, thank goodness. No, no seeds. It's it's. But it's very strong. Mm -hmm. It's delicious. I that like milk chocolate is heavenly. It's very creamy. Has a Candy. wonderful flavor. Yes. Um, I really like the raspberry in that. Yeah, that's that's nice. And I'm not a real huge raspberry lover, but that's really no, good. No, that's, uh, yeah. I definitely would choose the milk chocolate over the dark. Yeah. Uh, just, it's just so good. This one I'm excited about too. This is cappuccino. Filled milk chocolate with cappuccino truffle filling. A third of the bar, we're back to a third, has 190 calories. And this one doesn't, this one looks semi-dark. It's not quite as dark. It says milk chocolate. It just looks darker than the other it one. It does, it sure does. It looks like a cross between the two, yeah. doesn't it? Yeah. It, it really, it, it's not as light as the last uh, milk chocolate bar we had. No, sweet either. 
definitely get that cappuccino flavor, don't you? I love that. If you, if you like a creamy, it's a creamy coffee, but it's also a, it's strong. It's, it's strong creamy, coffee. but strong. Mm -hmm. And the chocolate is excellent. And I'm noticing on these packages, I don't know why they felt the need to cover up the writing with their own because there is English writing on the box. I mean, it says on the box from Germany. Okay, so now we're gonna try the marzipan. And this Any isn't, the, but, but this isn't just it's regular bad. marzipan. That's a dense, you feel that bar. That is uh, 3.9 ounces. These are 3.5 ounces. So it is a little heavier, it is. It's chunkier too. It's a marzipan with dark chocolate. But what I didn't know, um, it's dark chocolate filled with ginger marzipan. It's amazing that that's only that little bit lighter because picking it up feels very, very heavy. It's I mean, uh, hev it's heavier. heavier. That it's little bit that. heavier, yeah. It's a shiny dark chocolate. It's got so, writing on it too, but I can't read it. Oh, it does. It says their name. Okay. Uh, Nita Rigger. <laughs> the logo for me, I can't see. I don't have my glasses on. It looks like a skull and crossbones. <laughs> I can see that. Because um, it has like a, a logo and then like two swords crossed, but it, it looks just like skull and crossbones. It does. Um, so. It's a, like I said, dark chocolate filled with ginger yep. marzipan. Wow. There are four, star I felt some hit the back, back of my shirt. <laughs> it did. Um, it says a fourth of a package, 28 grams is 150 calories. So is this for me? Yeah. There's what the inside looks like. It's filled with this like The marzipan. Marzipan with seasonings, I guess. Look at the outside layer of chocolate on the on the outside. Look at that. How thick it is. But you're eating it, you know. Mm, that's super nice. I don't necessarily like the spice in there. I don't mind the ginger. I would have rather it been just plain Without, Mars Yeah, Man. I agree. When I bought the bar, I did not realize it had ginger. Now, in German, that probably says that it's ginger, but I didn't know that. Yeah. So what I went by was on the bottom of the bar, it just says marzipan yeah. with dark chocolate. You don't know that it's ginger. Of course, if I had read it better, if I hadn't been in a hurry to just scoop it up, um, it does say it on the back in English that it has ginger. For me, when I put that in my mouth, and honestly the whole way through, it was medicinal. It was like I, I was taking some kind of medicine, like if you've been sick or you, if you've had a head cold and you're trying to clear <laughs> clear out, it's, it's as if you're taking something for being sick. And I think it's just the combination of the dark chocolate and the ginger and, and, and the marzipan itself, mm -hmm. the, the almond and the marzipan. I think it's just the whole thing combined comes across as medicinal. Now, could I get used to that? I could, but this, I would not choose that. No. I just it would, would have been better with just the Mars Band. Yeah, but I'll tell you what, the chocolate, I've eaten just the piece of the chocolate. Their chocolate, their dark chocolate's wonderful. It's excellent quality. It is excellent quality. Yes, and, and so if you love that combination, it's great quality. I just don't want the, the ginger. ginger. Yeah, yeah. that spice in there does throw it off a bit. So, out of the four. It'd probably be the raspberry would be my number one. The raspberry would be mine too, and then the cappuccino. None yeah. would be the raspberry, then the uh, fudge. And then the, the, uh, uh, the mousse. mousse. Yeah, because yeah. I like, oh, I just like the flavor. I love the cappuccino though. If you like coffee, you're gonna love this bar. Now, they may sell these at World Market. For some reason, I'm thinking I've seen this brand at World Market and I've just never bought it because there's so many other brands to choose from. And there are other brands that World Market has too that I want to try. I just haven't gotten around to them. Um, so when I saw this at Jungle Gems, I thought, and they had so many, I thought, I'm going to try this. So if you um, don't have access to Jungle Gems, and not many people do because they're just in Ohio, um, then I would uh, totally look for this brand in a world market because it's excellent quality. It Just good. pick out whatever one sounds good to you and go for it. Um, Cause um, they're, they're, good. they're worth it. They're totally worth the money. Yep. They're big bars. 
Yeah, they're yeah. hefty bars. Yeah. So I will have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.